be making bases. What's going on YouTube? Be making basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe because we're coming back to back with bangers. Now today's video is a dope one. I'm going to be showing you the quickest way to transport, transpose your melodies up or down, um, you know, either an octave or even different notes within Logic Pro 10. A quick way to do it. Now to demonstrate this and show you what I even mean, I'm going to first let you listen to this beat and I'm going to show you the way that we would normally do it like the manual way and then I'm gonna show you the quickest way so check this out let's go this is the beat all right so that's the beat it's pretty lit it's going but say if I want to take this upper notch or, or, or change the uh, you know the octave of this Normally, if I wanted to change the octave, okay, this is played on a, uh, the, the note G. So I take it up to this next G. So the normal way would be to just drag it up. All right, so that's cool, but it can kind of be time consuming, especially, you know, the screen is small. You have to go there and zoom in and make sure you're doing all this stuff. It just kind of makes it a lot uh, more difficult. I'm gonna go do a Command Z to undo this. And then vice versa, if I wanted to take it up or notch, like just one semitone or down. So, and you, we would want to do that for multiple reasons. So sometimes, you know, you might want to take these 808s and just mute this out and say, hey, let me just play around with this and play it like a couple of notes up or not. All right, so that, that's why we want to learn how to do this. Now, let's talk about the quick quickest way to do it now. Um, if you actually come on this note, highlight it, and then right click on it, there's just these different options right here. This right here. You can either transpose this up 12 semitones or down 12 semitones. And what I mean by semitones is kind of basically like notes. And by going up 12 semitones, it's literally going to make it go up an octave higher than what it is now. So, like if I just click this, boom. Instantly. and vice versa, highlight it. I can take it back down with this option. Now that's cool, but like say if you wanna take it up a semitone or one note, you could do that as well. Up or down. So. But the key with this is the hot keys, okay? So if you know how to use the hot keys, that's what's really going to be what's gonna save the day for us, okay? So if you hold, if you highlight this and then hold down option and just, if you come to your keyboard and push the up and down keys, okay, on your, on your actual keyboard, That's gonna be a real easy tip. Option and the up and down arrows on your keyboard, okay? The up and down arrows usually should be right around the shift key um, or the return key, you know what I'm saying? Up or down arrows, all right? Now, if you also press option and hold down shift in the up and down arrows, that's gonna take it up a whole uh, octave. So when it talks about making music and just doing stuff quickly, you know what I'm saying? So say if I want to make a whole nother part. So we have this first part. If I want to turn this into a whole nother section of the beat, I can just take this, double this by pushing Command D, drag this down, hold down Option. It's going to make a copy of it, right? Then I can click on this, Command A to highlight everything. And then I can just literally push Option, shift, and then up or down to take it up or, or down an octave. Gonna save you a lot of time, man. Appreciate y'all watching. If you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Also, make sure you go over to my site, Beatmaking Basics. 
Com, man. We have full video courses with loads and loads of information like this that can help you with your uh, production process. If nothing else, it'll help you to be a better producer on the technical side, learning your software, you know, learning where to do, you know, how to do certain things. But anyway, I have lots of courses on, on the site you get and a couple of loop packs you can get as well in the drum pack. So make sure you go over there, visit, check those things out. I'm going to be doing a sale. Um, you know what I'm saying? Just to the end of the month. So make sure you go grab those before the sale goes back up to normal price. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.